always found this piece to be movingly, poignantly beautiful. And that feeling only deepened as I learned the piece on piano. Ambassadors is of a piece with Siren Song of the Weed Creature, heard in episode three of this project. Its foundation is a simple, trance-like, repeated figure, like a drone. Almost all of this piece's orchestration is electronically produced. The only exception is the presence of an unobtrusive vibraphone. The repeated accompaniment figure, played by the left hand, evokes in my mind the delicate and expressive string instruments of Asia, like the koto or the gujo, or the dreamlike strumming of a harp. The piano's damper pedal, constantly down, allows the harmony to surround and inundate. The harmonic basis for the majority of the piece is A-flat minor. The chord is colored by the beauty of the added minor 7th, G-flat, and the major 9th, B-flat. Once again, the gorgeous melody Simpson superimposes with its beautiful dissonances and resolutions is like an alien lament, full of longing, full of soul. Perhaps I'm too rhapsodic about this piece, but I adore it. As I've done previously, the timbre of the electronics suggested the melody be played in octaves rather than as a single note, and this is done throughout. The first notes of the melody immediately immerse you in this alien sound. With A flat as the bass, the melody note begins on D natural, the tritone. I notate this as E double flat, not to be pretentious or difficult, but because the note evokes for me the flatted fifth of the blues. If the fifth is E flat, the flatted fifth is E flat flat. The melody bounces off another note before returning to E double flat, and it's a surprising ornament, C natural. This is only a whole step away from D natural, that's E double flat when it's at home, but it's yet another instance of Simpson using the major third when the harmony underneath is minor third. It bounces off one more note, D flat this time, before returning to E double flat. From here, the melody rises up to G flat, the minor seventh, which is already present in the harmony, glancing off an F natural ornament. These notes suggest the Dorian mode, a scale choice commonly used in jazz for minor chords, because no note in the scale is truly dissonant when, with the harmony, allowing a freedom of melodic choice. The melody, next, makes a beautiful leap up to the flatted fifth, again, E double flat. But now it sinks to D flat, itself slowly resolving diatonically to the minor third C flat, first heard as another ornament. Then B flat and its eventual resolution to A flat, home, concludes the first of the melody's phrases.
The second phrase starts the same as the first, up to the G flat. The leap up to E double flat happens again, but a little earlier rhythmically. And then, we've now had the A flat minor harmony for about 40, 45 seconds, a long time in musical terms. And as the melody again sinks from E double flat to D flat, the music peaks. The harmony shifts brightening up slightly to F minor, with color notes of the minor 7th, E-flat, and the 11th. The 11th being the same B-flat that was the major 9th of the A-flat minor harmony, and is thus a key note linking the two harmonies. The downward strumming accompaniment starts always on B flat. Additionally, the D flat melody is slightly at odds with the F minor harmony, whose notes contain the adjacent C natural, bringing that much more beauty in its tension. I always find this shift in harmony so moving as to be almost cathartic. The melody slows in activity, reveling in each new note per measure, but after only four measures of F minor, the harmony returns to A flat minor, and the melody settles on the alien E double flat once more. After all this, you get to float through it all again. There is a written, literal repeat of the entire thing, excluding the introductory two measures, and holding the final melody note two more bars as the harmonic strumming comes to an end. Tune in next time for another episode of the Dudley Simpson Is Doctor Who Project. 
Thank you very much for watching episode five, part two. Don't forget, subscribe, like, share, comment, and anything else you can think of. See you next time.